Hey guys, today I'm going to try to uh, install the uh, $20 dish light bracket for the uh, 2010 Toyota 4Runner and up. Um, I'm not sure I'm going to fit the uh, GX, but it's only 20 bucks, so try it out, see if it, see if it works or not. Um, if, if it does work, I'm going to post a link into the description. and. Uh, so you can get it as well. So it's only 20 bucks, you know, uh, compared to all the other that made specifically for the GX. This is like over 100 bucks for the entire kit. But uh, this kit for the Toyota 4Runner, only $20 or some change uh, on Amazon. So let's get to it. It's uh, sim it looks like it is a very um, simple bracket, right? And it, it comes with two, one for each size. And it's also come with some nuts and bolts. Alright, let's get to it. Use those 10 millimeters. Take these off. Okay. Looks like it fit pretty well. Okay, so now um, I got this set of the uh, Lich Light. So now I'm going to try to see if it actually fit with that new bracket which I installed up there. The relay for the uh, dish light fuse so show 30 amps. So we gotta pick the the green one 30 amp and test it out to see if that actually work. Red to positive. Make a little hook. Do the same for the negative cable. Okay. Time 
There you go. So we know now. Now we know it works. Let's test the other one before we mount everything together on both sides, and we should be done with a lit light. the dish light on one side now we can go to go ahead and do the other side I figured out uh, an easy way to put the bracket up easier to go ahead and hold up the hood is by remove completely one of the the bolt and then uh, Slap that on, screw that in, and then unscrew the other one. Or you hold this in place, make it much easier. Put the other one on. Just like that. like that. <clears throat> Here you go. I should pull the cover, the engine cover up. It make it easier to get access back there to route a cable from that side all the way here to the switch. Uh, all I had to do with the whole both side, yank it up. You can see right here, this one will hold up the, uh, hold out the uh, engine bay cover. There's two of them. There's one right here, and there's one right there. That's it. The wire nicely stuck back there. And connect to our swim. Ox. Here's a final look. <coughs> Both sides fit pretty good. So the uh, bracket for uh, the Toyota 4 Runner 2010 and up fit on a GX perfectly. Um, I never done any installation like this before and I was able to do it a little over an hour. So I'm pretty sure you guys can do this as well. Uh, that's include mount the bracket and a ditch light, connect the ditch light to the switch. I will post the link in the description to the exact same bracket that I got. So you can try that out as well. Thanks for watching. Bye.